Thank you very much, Madam President. The NATO summit took place in Lisbon, and as such, perhaps you'll allow me to say a few words as to what happened in my country uh, during this summit. Now, at the time, the Portuguese authorities um, prevented a certain people from coming to Portugal during the summit because they had critical views of the alliance. Now, we had an arbitrary regime and uh, police state in the past in Portugal, but it seems that um, Portugal has spent 5 billion euros on sorry, 5 million euros for equipment for this summit and it didn't arrive on time and this is for a country where the government is going through a massive social crisis. Now, the dream of freedom of expression is a fundamental right in the European Union and we don't want to have to deal with military organizations uh, where uh, rules are written in blood. Now, the European Union has to um, act carefully and not just follow the American line. But we also have to think about access to energy resources. Now, we're also seeing a move towards instability as well in the name of uh, development cooperation. But in fact, with this summit, we lost in democracy. We're lost out in terms of uh, development for in the name of war.